Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Larry Meister here, and today we're, uh, it's a Tuesday. Uh, something, something, I don't know. What to look. Let me look at the calendar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Tuesday, January 14th, 8 12 in the morning. What the hell am I doing awake? Uh, I tell you what, uh, my schedule has changed once again, and we're gonna play some Warcraft 3 as I talk on and I try to talk on because. I usually don't multitask. I could I could have just filmed this and uh, filmed the gameplay and then recorded over with my voice, but I decided not to. And yeah, so here we are. We're gonna jump right in. I haven't played this game in so long, and it's one of my top favorite games. Oh shit! Okay, let's try that one more time. All right, I just had a bit of a crash right there, and I don't know what just happened. <clears throat> I, uh, off screen, I, I restarted and tried playing the game again, and uh, it worked just fine. So maybe there's some mishaps between fraps, and if it happened again, then I am not off to a good start. <laughs> uh, I really hate fraps now. They are so behind. I have no idea what's going on. They're not updating. They haven't updated it since February 2012. And I'm starting to get concerned because uh, now I'm going to have to find some alter alteration of uh, game recording. And if you guys have any suggestions of uh, software that I can record with, uh, please, by all means, comment. I mean, I really would like a better software that's up to date and that can record gameplay. So hopefully, this doesn't crash again. Uh, so far, seems what I kind of started it um, already. So I'm just gonna skip the cinematic. Um, hopefully this works. Yeah, it seems to be working. Great. Well, now I'm concerned that if I'm recording or not, and hopefully I am. So, here we go. Oh, this brings me back. Anyway, this video really is not about Warcraft 3. It's just me rambling on. And uh, this is uh, Warcraft 3, uh, The Frozen Throne. One of my favorite of all time PC games. And uh, uh, I'm not here to talk about the game itself, but I'm here to talk about... A few things I uh, did not mention in my vlog yes. update number two for my uh, channel. Yes. So uh, what happened is I mentioned that I might be starting a uh, a YouTube uh, network. Uh, finding that YouTube network is a bit more complicated than that. You're gonna need some lawyers. You're gonna need some. Uh, you're gonna need a lot of things in order to. <laughs> get that started and I didn't really think about it I did research before but I didn't know it would be that complicated and uh, and a lot and a lot of it is investing a lot of money into it and you have to have a lot of uh, viewers a lot of subscribers yourself in order to even be contracted with uh, YouTube so I don't know if it's ever even gonna happen yet, but I'm still wanting to do it. And people have asked me like, "Well, when's it gonna be up? How's it gonna work?" Well, it's it's gonna be it's not it's it's gonna be a bit of a long path. See, it's it's not gonna be overnight. So don't expect it to be up in 2014. Don't expect it to be up early 2015. But expect it as like it's gonna be a growing. Uh, basically, what I want to start is a small community, and then from that little community, we're gonna spark it up from there. And there's gonna be a bit of a council and officers and stuff like that. And it, and if it works that way, then and only then we can become a uh, a multi-channel network so that's how it's gonna yeah it's just gonna be kind of like polaris how they do uh like you know jesse cox or wild crindor they're part of a network called polaris and uh so is total biscuit if i if i'm correct and uh this again is um 
It takes some time and it takes a lot of uh, other things to do. So, in the meantime, what we're gonna do, uh, if you want to join in, me and we all guess just help out at the channel and uh, help each other out. And basically, uh, hopefully, we get that started. In other news, uh, we got some uh, gaming news. Uh, this I just bought uh, SimCity 4 last year. Yeah, SimCity 4. No, not SimCity 4. That's the Iron Man. I'm sorry for that. Uh, not SimCity 4, but the new SimCity from EA, and they are going offline. They have a single player coming out soon. They have already announced it. Go to SimCity.com and uh, read that up. And it seems pretty cool to me, but they can't maximize the city limits. That's unfortunate. And another few things. Uh, uh, I just had to go for a few th games right now, any games I want to want to do, want to want to cover, and I'm probably gonna start doing more YouTube lately. As far as my medical thing, you heard me talk about on the vlog number two. Uh, don't worry really about that. Uh, I just gonna need to buy new medical services, new, new, uh, uh, you know, just a brand new, a more cheaper. Uh, altered uh, insurance, but you know, just don't worry about me. All right, you know. Anyway, uh, let's see more gaming news. Xbox One is gonna have a new interface at some point. Not a brand new one from the start, but definitely uh, something that will help all the bug fixes and all the friendships and stuff like that. I have an Xbox One and and an Xbox 360, so if you want a game on that. By all means, just uh, I'll link my. Well, I won't link my uh, profile, but I will give you my GT name, which should be popped up, um, in the description of the video below. So, um, go ahead and uh, add me to your friendship if you want to be friends on uh, Xbox One, or or do you want to be? Uh, 360. I, I don't usually play 360 as much as often as I used to do, but uh, hey, you know, I still play Grand Theft Auto 5 and all that, and plus that's re part of the reason why I haven't uploaded many, many videos, because I've been toying with my Xbox One, and uh, I have a few games on there, like Assassin's Creed 4, and, and I have to tell you, the difference between <coughs> Assassin's Creed 4, excuse me, uh, and if on the Xbox One and the uh, 360 is that the graphics are much, much more beautiful and uh, I like it a lot so good difference, good difference and Titanfall is coming out and on eh, it's hard to say I can't tell if it's say but it's like March I think is when they're coming out and another good game this 2014 is well actually a few of them, a few of them to the top of my head uh, for starters, they have uh, Titanfall and Destiny and Elder Scrolls Online. I'm looking up to the Division as well. A few online games, which is uh, pretty cool. So, yeah. Alright, so what else is there? There's a lot of few things I want to discuss, but uh, it is Tuesday morning and I have to go to work in about five hours, but I've been sleeping all weekend and I'd just be on quite rested actually I've been sleeping all weekend and I, this feels now great I feel really good and uh, for those that haven't I feel sorry now for you <laughs> um, well hey you know the week isn't that you know the weekend isn't that long I mean think about it when Friday is just around the corner even if it's on Tuesday it's like ah uh, I can survive you know survive three more days and then I get uh, I get the weekend off again yeah, I think in terms of that. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna fight the, this bad guy. Alright. I don't know if you want to read that or not, but... I think pause the video. Uh, there's a few indie games I want to get off Steam. And, uh... Oh! Oh, 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 oh. I also got access to... Project Spark. I don't know if, uh, if any of you have a uh, Project Spark. But I just got access to the beta, and I'm so thrilled. It is gonna be like the, such a success game uh, development. Like you create your own game from whatever it is, from 
first person shooter, third person shooter. I'm really excited from the features it gives you. Like, it's not all com complex, you know, it's, it's pretty simple stuff. I mean, I guess it could be kind of complicated in some degree um, from the looks of it. I can't really record it because it's not because of NDA. NDA, uh, there is no NDA, so I could record it. However, Fraps does not allow me to, and uh, I also downloaded a few other uh, softwares I could probably, because I really wanted to do a full-on review of with it, uh, or a preview because it's in beta, but unfortunately, uh, Fraps does not record Windows 8.1 uh, application games, which is sad, so, yeah, yeah. well, well, anyway, um, some of these things, uh, like I talked to, uh, see that I could talk to Penguin. Uh, glad you have uh, responded to my video and uh, talked to you a little bit there. And uh, yeah, and it's all good news and everything for the channel. But again, with the whole network and stuff, uh, it's going to be a bit longer, dude. Sorry. And yeah, I uh, did not look it through Lee. Uh, legal the legal stuff <laughs> which I should have have but I didn't and that that's that's gonna be a stopper for me at the point until I figured out how how it directly works and with networking and everything so yeah how about that man um, let's see what else yes I'm gonna be doing more minecraft in fact minecraft has allowed to do uh, live streaming there's a feature in game now where you can live stream to Twitch, and I want to start Twitch. It sounds like a good idea, and I'm not. I don't know, but I want to see what I can get my fingers digged into because this this new Twitch idea just seems like a good a a good plan. It says YouTube uh, ID content thing has just been um, smaller channels like myself or anybody else that use ID content uh, profiling. It, uh, it does affect smaller people who are not protected by networks like myself. Um, it does affect, and I have a few claims like World of Warcraft because of the music. So I had to, when I play a, a game, I have to make sure the ambience music or something that could be infringed by copyright. I have to be careful with that, uh, you know, with that little claim. Uh, it's just an auto claim thing. It basically, what it does is that the big companies they send a data file to YouTube, and that data file is put on into their database. And if it if it matches the music or the content, then they can have an auto claim for your video. So, um, but again, the music and the uh, and the gaming content are, are much different because the gaming industry, they usually uh, they usually license these music before they uh, produce the con content. So that's the whole idea of the IT content match. Then so it's just, it's just a weird system, but it, it, that's how it works. All right, Elodin, what do you got for me? All right, Elodin running away like a little bitch he is. So we're gonna have to chase him down. Um, so yeah, the whole ID content is rather, it is, it really sucks for small, uh, less players like myself, because we can't use the, uh, full content to its fullest, so, and, yeah, it just sucks, so. Alright, so let's, let's get to finish this mission real quick, and then we're gonna wrap this video up. Uh, again, I am going to probably... Take uh, Penguin's suge suggestion on this and take it down to 720. I mean, there's not a real big difference except, you know, it's still HD and it does take it, it does process faster. And, uh, <clears throat> excuse me again. Um, again, it's HD still, so, you know, you don't have to complain or anything. And I, when I upload my videos, I make sure that my uh, videos are processed. Um, quality as possible and people who they see complainers and stuff like that um, you don't have to complain much but yeah, yeah you, you know what I mean I, oh shit I didn't realize 
Okay, I have to hurry this up because this guy, they are hammering down the boats. Okay, I, I think that boat's saved. Yeah, we, okay. Alright, uh, there we go. Uh, yep. Alright, last Naga. I don't play WoW as much as I do anymore. In fact, I don't have a subscription anymore. So, if you're thinking like I play WoW, uh, Warcraft, means I play WoW. Well, I do, but I don't anymore. So. Uh, let's see. I ain't listen to this anyway. I, if you play Warcraft 3, you can get Warcraft 3 actually. You can buy Warcraft 3 off of Blizzard.net and Warcraft 2, I think. Warcraft, eh, it could be there. But anyway, thank you for listening on Tuesday's edition. And uh, my name is Blade Meister. And that is what is on my thoughts. Game rambling on, uh, game rambling on gaming, basically. So if you have any suggestions for the channel, if you have any suggestions for the networks and uh, how it works, uh, how the network I have in mind is on the vlog number two. Description to that video is on the below. And again, thank you for watching. My name is Larry Meister. Have a great day. Later.